Many people may not know that animals play a large role in keeping people healthy. Purdue University researchers are using a $1.3 million grant to help further students understand the role animals do play in our lives. The Study Abroad office is located here at Purdue's Young Hall, room 105. Students looking for more information can visit studyabroad.purdue.edu. I'm Karina Gonzalez reporting for Fast Track. Bicycles have always been a quick and easy way to get around on campus here at Purdue. But as complaints mount about bikes, tickets are being issued and a bigger plan is in the works. Where I am standing is actually one of the few places West Lafayette has stationed two officers for several hours a day to write warnings and set expectations. Purdue's Discovery Learning Research Center in Discovery Park will be responsible for assessing the project to determine their effectiveness. I'm Karina Gonzalez reporting for Fast Track. Purdue's annual Greek service day is about bringing together all the fraternities and sororities in the pursuit of helping the community. This year's service day made a significant impact. Fast Track reporter... ...September with its best attendance yet. We can proudly in the nation. We went to find out how students should prepare for next year and what it's really all about. Catherine Ducharme has more. Another Purdue tradition isn't a club or an object, it's a person. The girl in black has been around for 51 solid years and is an iconic figure here on Purdue's campus. Fast Track reporter Alexandra Johnson has the story. Grand Theft Auto is played from a third-person perspective in an open-world environment, allowing the player to interact with the game world at their leisure. While many might believe these violent games are frowned upon, Santoro believes otherwise. Glenn Sparks, a professor in the College of Liberal Arts here at Purdue, has experience in general research on the effects of mass media and the impact of violent video games. He believes Grand Theft Auto has become a more violent video game throughout the years, which raises some concerns for its players. There have been some uh, uh, dramatic instances that have been uh, reported in the press where people have actually engaged in what we call copycat behavior or imitative behavior where they, uh, there was one, uh, one incident uh, recently where uh, uh, an adolescent decided to just go out and try to replicate a scenario in the game to see what it would feel like. And so uh, he got into an automobile and just started uh, going around and shooting. President Mitch Daniels has just unveiled the outline on 10 campus initiatives, one being putting a handle on the bike situation on campus. Fall is always the busiest time for bikes here at Purdue. Due to all the chaos, students are opinionated on the topic. In only three weeks, police have written more than 200 violations. Most of them were warnings and a few $25 tickets for repeated offenders. The School of Veterinary Medicine is working with several other Purdue departments and organizations to create a broad program. We have partnered with teachers from elementary, middle school, and high school, and we've provided them information and they've developed curriculum that is age-specific for their kids. And the curriculum meets Indiana academic standards. 